This video provides a quick overview of how you can contribute to any of our public GitHub repositories. Although it's being released alongside our initiative to translate all apostrophe CMS extensions, the information is applicable to any public GitHub repository, regardless of whether it's associated with apostrophe CMS or not. Before contributing changes to the translation JSON files, make sure that the repository you want to contribute to doesn't already have an open PR for that language. If it does, please add comments to that PR instead. First, go to the GitHub repository you want to contribute to. Click on the Fork button at the top right corner to create a copy of the repository in your personal GitHub account. Next, clone your forked repository to your local machine. Copy the URL and use the git clone command in your terminal within the directory where you want the code base to be copied. Navigate to your new repository folder and create a new branch for your feature or bug fix. Open the code in the editor of your choice. Make changes to the corresponding files that you want to update. Once you're done, save your work and commit your changes with a clear message. Then push those changes to GitHub. How you do this will depend on your preferences and what tools your editor might have available. Go back to the forked repository on GitHub and click on Compare and Pull Request. Read the template carefully. First, provide a clear description of your changes. Next, check the boxes for the type of change, that you provided a clear summary, and that you updated the change log. For the translations, you don't need to update any documentation or tests, so those boxes don't need to be checked. Finally, submit your pull request. Once you've submitted your pull request, someone from the apostrophe team will review it. If everything is okay, they'll approve it. In some cases, they may ask you to make changes. If that happens, go back, update your code, Commit the changes and ask for a re-review either in GitHub or on our Discord. Thanks for contributing to open source. 